A five-year-old was seriously injured after her mother's boyfriend threw her from a third-floor apartment balcony, believing she was a demon. Jarek Willis, a 32-year-old man, was arrested after being shot by Angela Matthews, his girlfriend, after she learned that he threw her child off the balcony. This incident occurred around 4.45 p.m. The young girl was found by police unconscious on the ground of the apartment complex. The mother said she learned of the incident when her son screamed that Willis had tossed her child over the balcony. Matthews told police that her boyfriend could be seen leaning over the balcony with the young girl's body below. A neighbor who witnessed all of this said that the child landed face first on the gravel. Fearing for the lives of the other children, the mother shot Willis in a bathroom confrontation. A day before the incident, the boyfriend told Matthews that her child was a demon. Angela said she and Jarek practice and believe in African spirituality. And on Saturday, Jarek started talking about how he believed that her five-year-old daughter was full of bad spirits. Matthews told him to stop talking about her daughter in that way, to which she indicated Jarek apologized to her. The five-year-old sustained a broken forearm, pelvis, leg, rib, and a collapsed lung, and a possible fractured sternum, according to police report. Willis was sent to a local hospital with critical injuries and faces child abuse, neglect, domestic battery, and attempted murder charges. Wow. Family, family, family. We definitely have to be careful out here. You have to be careful, especially for you women. You have to be careful about what man you have around your children. Because when he made that statement, you probably should have grabbed that pistol then and started escorting him out your house. As soon as he said your child had a demon in him, you should have definitely got your pistol and said, hey, you got to get up out of here. Think about it. And I thought about this part too. It said, Angela said, she and Jarek practice and believe in African spirituality. I'm not really privy to African spirituality, but just looking at it from hindsight view, think about it. They deal with the masks and diff the different kind of masks and uh, voodoos and stuff like that. So you think about it. You dealing with these different uh, groups of spirituality groups and they pumping your head up telling you oh yeah you got a demon on you you don't know what they might be telling you and have your mind twisted that's why if you're going to deal in any spiritual system you have to do your own research don't let them tell you this is how it goes uh this is what this is don't have a leader in it. If you're going to deal with any school of thought, you gonna you need to be your own researcher so you can find out the pros and cons about it. Is this something you want to be a part of? Because if you do it and allow another man or woman to lead you, they're going to lead you into this kind of stuff right here. And I'm pretty sure that had something to do with it. That's why she mentioned it to the police. She mentioned it to the police. Hey, we practice African spirituality. Meaning what? It's demons being casted out. We're dealing with the, the voodoo and the different stuff like that. So family, y'all gotta be careful out here when you're dealing with stuff and dealing with people. And did he introduce her to it? We don't know. 
That's another thing. Don't allow nobody to just introduce you to anything without you doing your proper research, doing your due, di doing your due diligence on it before you get into it. And that's a must. And with that, I'm going to say this is the news in you. North, east, west, south. Unite from every alley in Cali. Intersection and back street. Subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up on your way out the door. I'm not who you think I am. Your perception is a lesson with a fail grade on it. Yeah. Steady living life like I would never see the morning. True shit, man, I'm more than pain. I'm more than staying on sidewalk. I'm more than black skin on my face. Destined to be great. Gotta elevate. Mind elevation is the game that I gotta play. Gotta win. Gotta find escape to a better day.